Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Beautiful. Beautiful. You have a wonderful smile. Thank you. So do you. Thank you. Today we're talking about Mitt Romney. He was treated for prostate cancer over the summer back in 2017. His prognosis is good, but what about his orgasms now? Since he already had a, what you call a, I mean, robotic prostatectomy. Yes. So his, he definitely had a problem with his orgasm. Right. Technically, I don't think he had an orgasm at all. It's gone. Right. After the research we've done. But let me explain to you that the book which I have written, the book is called Orgasm, Prescription for Condition Unconsciousness. And you're reading the book. Exactly. And there's a chapter there in the book called The Orgasm. Right. I don't know whether you get a chance to read it or not, but I think everybody should read that chapter. And once you understand that the, what you call real orgasm, when it really takes place, that's where the mind stops. That's where the space stops. Exactly. That's where the ego stops. And it's only a very short period. And we, we are looking that a man and a woman both should get at that stage so they can understand that the mind disappeared, the time disappeared, the ego disappeared. That is where the meditation starts. That's where the enlightenment takes place. Exactly. But unfortunately, people are using in the wrong way. They are using like a sexuality. That's a mind phenomenon. Right. But it is a sacred relation. Exactly. Which all of us should respect that, and that's how we are born. Right. So what a person should do? Not to lose their orgasm. Exactly. Before undergoing any surgery, if you're diagnosed with prostate cancer, please give me a call. My name is Arlene and my telephone number is 941-363-1517 and we can make a difference. Thank you. You all have a good day. God bless.